United, the United States is a corporation. We know that. Mm -hmm. So you got to approach it as a corporation. You don't try to beat them with a dollar. You don't try to beat them with military. You don't try to beat them at all. You beat them with family. They can't deal with that. It's mm -hmm. too powerful for them. Mm -hmm. A healthy child won't go for any of this stuff. No mm -hmm. kind of way. We beat them with family. That's family. how we beat them. Mm -hmm. Very good. So, Dr. Africa, our time is, is really drawn oh, to Oh, I think we just started. Yeah, we have a lot of stuff. We're like, no, we, we just, just started. You put me on, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We just started. Man. We, we can get an extension. I'm just in. Excuse me, there's something that happened and you have like 30 minutes left. Okay. <laughs> okay. Thank okay. you, peace and love. Thank you. You can work with the next half hour? Sure. All right, all right. We can go into some remedies or whatever. That's all they really want to hear anyway. What's that? <laughs> remedies. Remedies. <laughs> That's all they want to hear. <laughs> take my blood pressure or whatever. All right. Well, let's get into some remedies then. Okay. Let's get into some remedies. I heard you speak a little bit earlier about like chickweed. What are some of the good things or what are some of the things that chickweed are good for knowing that before we even get into that, is that people more or less would have to kind of like change or start to change what they're doing mm, and don't really yeah. expect to take the herbs and still do stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah they, they can't approach, approach herbs like it's allopathic medicine, yeah. which I'm saying MD medicine. They, they want a magical pill, a magical herb. It's not that. You are the magic because you were born. You mm -hmm. were created by God. You are the magic. You don't have to look for a miracle. You are the miracle. That's right. But we're always looking for a miracle outside of ourselves. Mm -hmm. So we have these herbs, uh, chickweed, which was get, used to be used for measles. Mm -hmm. It's good for skin diseases and colds, okay. but it's also good for uh, controlling appetite. And that's primarily what, what I use it for. Okay, now, chickweed, what are some of its major um, components? Well, when you get into the breakdown of like the minerals and, yeah. and vitamins, it, understanding what we're talking about is a language here. Mm -hmm. and. When you say minerals, you're just referring to, some people say ices, a minera, a minette, mm -hmm. which means nourishment. All it means is nourishment. Mineral means nourishment. Mm -hmm. So you have a mineral, and in science we say this mineral is a vital mineral. So we call it a vitamin. vitamin. Mm -hmm. Then we say this vitamin is helping you to, to do action. It's just helping you. And if it's helping you to have action, we call it a hormone. But if it's participating in the action, we call it an enzyme. Okay. So by definition, all minerals are vitamins. All vitamins are hormones, and all hormones are enzymes. Okay. We're just talking about a behavior of a mineral. That's all we're talking about. Because mm -hmm. we're limited to a certain amount of minerals in the body. We got copper, we got iron, we got zinc. It's, it's like the furniture in this room. Mm -hmm. We just move your chair over there, and we call it copper. Mm -hmm. Move the chair there, we call it iron. All We're right. just limited. It's just the way in which we arrange these components mm -hmm. that we call iron, for instance. Mm -hmm. And that's essentially all it is. But to get into this fragmentation of it all is when we really lose it. Okay. Because fragmentation, breaking up stuff. It takes away the spiritual essence of it. Right. We got to deal with the whole thing. Everything mm -hmm. comes packaged, already complete. Mm -hmm. When you start busting it up, you're trying to play God. All right. So we have iron, which people associate with women. Because women lose iron when they menstruate, because hemoglobin or the red blood cell requires iron. So we say when a lady's menstruating, she's losing red blood, and red blood has iron in it, so she becomes iron deficient, deficient. during menstruation. But it's just not iron. It's a lot of other, other stuff, I believe. Iron works in the family. So we have a problem here. The body is built for this activity. But in order to retain the iron that it needs, the kidneys pull the iron out the urine so you won't pee it out. Mm -hmm. And the kidneys pull the iron out the urine and send it to the liver for storage. Okay. So you, the lady would never drop down too low in iron because she's storing it in her liver. Mm -hmm. but the problem is we have a weak liver. And we never address the weak liver in medicine. We say take iron tablets, yeah. iron tablets. But the liver should store about seven times more iron in a woman than a man. So how does the, 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 does the stomach actually absorb iron if it's, if it's in a pill form or something like that? Does it really? Uh, no. Iron? The iron you're talking about is made, the same iron they use to make cars yeah. or buildings, steel, and no, no, no. It has to be encased in a plant. If it's right. in a plant, mm -hmm. then the body can absorb, absorb the iron, which we're talking yellow dock, mm -hmm. 
which is high in iron, which is a herb, yellow dock, right. mm -hmm. and dandelion root. Mm -hmm. Dandelion root and yellow dock combined together would take care of iron deficiency anemia. All right. The objective is to make the lady emotional. Iron is associated with the rational part of your brain. So if she loses iron, she loses the ability to rationalize and become too emotional, okay. which throws the man off because he doesn't have the emotional vocabulary anyway, which weakens the relationship, mm -hmm. which makes the relationship fall apart, which makes both of them rely on their mother and father known as the government. The objective is to manipulate the lady. Mm -hmm. We're still back to this whole right. objective, but we don't see it as a military attack. So I, I'm saying that Yes, the ladies can replenish their iron with yellow dock and dandelion root. It should present mm -hmm. no problem. Okay. What about um, the some of the cause? What are the, the root cause and some of the remedies for like stuff like fibroids? Uh, fibroids. I know there's a whole spiritual thing involved yeah. with that as well. Yeah, I leave that spiritual stuff to those spiritual people. Okay. Uh, we're talking about uterine fibroids. Uterine fibroids and yeah. We have a uterus, and inside the fiber of the uterus is a tumor, and a tumor is the medical word for a bump. Mm -hmm. So we have a bump inside the muscle fiber of the uterus. That's essentially what we're dealing with. Mm -hmm. And a bump is the way the body packages toxins so they won't contaminate all the rest of the skin. So it's a defense mechanism of the body to protect the body from these toxins and encase them in a bump, which so we call the bumps it a tumor. Built up toxins. Yes, okay. that's what we're essentially talking about. And where these toxins are coming from can come from the sperm, can come from the latex condom, can come from the hydrocarbons. Hydrocarbons are a byproduct of making gasoline. That is the leading element we use to make preservatives. 90% of the preservatives are made from gasoline waste. That's what I'm essentially saying. Okay. And so the, anyone that's taking in preservatives are contaminating their body. And the area that's most sensitive to contamination is the breast and the uterus because it, this is sustaining life. Okay. So if you get toxins down there, the body says, nope, I better encase this so it won't hurt this uterus because I got to produce a child out of here. Mm -hmm. So the waste is coming from the preservatives, the latex condom, the impurities in the sperm itself, coming from the birth control pill, coming from the synthetic dish solution, coming from those toxic hydrocarbons, which ladies call perfume and cologne, which will blind you if you put them in the eyes, coming from hair relaxers, okay. which are made from lye. Mm -hmm. All of these things are traveling around in the blood. But when they get down to that uterus, the body says, wait a minute, you mess with my ability to reproduce life, I'm going to package this thing so it won't hurt me. So what we, we realize that this is just another hole that the body uses to dump out waste, like you have the anus mm -hmm. and the ureters peeing and urinating yeah, and bowel yeah. movements. That's a way of dumping waste out, and this is another way in which the body can dump waste out. If the lady gets stressed, she can tense up the uterus, and she tense up the uterus muscles, mm -hmm. it holds more waste in it. Okay. So all of this stressing by not having a good relationship, mm -hmm. not making enough money, not having a Lexus, whatever the stress <laughs> is, a bad episode yeah, yeah, of Oprah, yeah. soap operas, all mm -hmm. of that stress in the lady's system. So we generally try to shrink the tumors with a herb like shepherd's purse. Okay. A shepherd that works with the sheep, mm -hmm. shepherd's purse, shepherd's a lady's purse, purse shepherd's purse, mm -hmm. and another herb called wild alum, A-L-U-M, okay. root. Mm -hmm. Those root. would shrink the, the tumor, but it wouldn't dissolve the